What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here, bringing you a brand new series here on Aviator Games. You guys, today we embark on a new journey called The Sims 4 Aliens. Now let me explain what this series is about. So basically, two aliens, a boy and a girl, were out on a date, flying around the universe. And all of a sudden, their spaceship kind of, I don't know, came into some trouble. And as they lost control of the ship, it crashed down on Earth! and the ship was destroyed. Now they're stranded on Earth with no way to get back to their home planet, and they're fearing for their lives. They have to try to blend in with all the other Sims on Earth, so that way they're not exposed for their alien ways. Well, that is until they can finally get off the planet and go back home. But that's probably a long, long ways away. But guys, before we get started with this series, if you're excited for this brand new show, make sure you destroy that like button right now. Smash it, hit the grab out of it, do whatever you can do to destroy that like button right now if you guys are excited for a new series. It's been so long since we've had a new series here on Aviator Games, and I'm really excited to bring this one to you guys because I know it's going to be a ton of fun. And also, guys, in the comments down below, I don't know, make some predictions, some guesses. What do you think is going to happen in this series? I'd love to see your guys' ideas. But okay, let's Let's get started by creating a new family. Now we have to create aliens, which is going to be interesting because I've never really messed Rush around with aliens. And uh, I know we can go here to add an alien. So let's do that. Let's add an alien. Now aliens have two looks as you can see. They have the, uh, you know, their disguise look and then what their real look is. So we're going to be basically designing uh, sims in two different ways. Let's delete that sim. Okay, so the first sim, we're going to go with a guy alien. He's going to be the guy that was piloting the ship on this date. What we're going to do is lower his weight, lower his muscle just a little bit. There we go. I'm liking it. So let's try to <laughs> make our alien look more personable okay so we're gonna go with a longer skinnier face ooh that's creepy those eyes what about like a Shrek face oh my god okay hold on now let me can I do this face with a green oh I can okay hold on let's have like manlier oh wait you get a white oh that's weird okay so let's go with green cuz when I think aliens I think green for some reason now this is what our aliens gonna look like if he ever chooses to expose himself and I think, uh, you know, one day we might out ourselves to some people. This is our space suit. This is what we probably crash landed in. So we're going to go with, I like this uh, one right here. We're going to go with this suit. This was our space suit when we crash landed. This is what we were wearing. Is there a space helmet? Is there? Because that would be amazing. I, I doubt there is. Oh my god, there's <laughs> there is a few types of helmets. We could be wearing like something like this. Like, yeah, we were wearing this when we crash landed, guys. Okay, let's see what else is there that we could have possibly been wearing on our heads during the cl crash landing. Nah, <laughs> nothing else is very space-like. So I think, you know what, we're going to go with no hat. Let's exit the hats. So there we go. Can we have hair on our alien? Yes, we can. So I already know the hair style I want to use for the guy alien. And it's down. Did I pass it? It's like a wavy. There it is. Okay, I want to do this with the blue. Okay, this is the kind of style I want, and I want to do the same with facial hair. I think facial hair will be kind of cool on our alien sim here. Uh, I don't know what kind of style I want to go with. Probably that. So there we go. That is our alien sim as his alien state. Now what we have to do is make his disguise state. What he looks like as a human. Now, but first we're going to name him. Now, guys, I have a great name planned out for him. I wanted to use Rocket as his name. Uh, it's like a space travel thing, and it's also from Guardians of the Galaxy. Rocket the raccoon. And now their last name I want to be Milky Way. Because the Milky Way galaxy, I think it's a galaxy, is uh, up in space. So Milky Way makes sense. So Rocket Milky Way, that's his name. Now let's disguise his human persona. Now we want to attract a lot. We don't want to attract a lot of attention to his human persona. Because we want him to just kind of blend with the crowd. We don't want any Sims catching on that he's different than anyone else. So we're going to go with brown. I think hair, just something very just common and mundane. I have brown hair so I can say offensive things like this. Maybe like brown eyes too. And then let's go to facial hair and we're going to keep the same facial hair I think. Just to kind of, uh, I don't know, keep a consistency here. Now let's go to faces. Uh, let's try, you know, more of a chiseled look to the face. I like that. I like that look a lot. Okay, so now what I want to do is get some style looks because aliens have no idea how we dress. <laughs> he didn't do any research. So we're going to try to style him up in a way that doesn't attract attention. And this outfit, I think, kind of does. So we're going to try to be a little bit more, I don't know, blended. So let's see what we can find that's going to just make him feel more mundane. 
more overlooked, more glossed over, somebody that wouldn't pay attention to them very much. Let's see. Ooh, no. I don't like any of these. Cowboy hat doesn't really get me going there. Dang it. Okay, so two, some of these are too plain. So what I want to do is I think I'm going to go back to this one. We're going to mess with the colors a little bit. Okay, so this isn't a half bad look. What if I did the darker colors? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so let's try this color. Okay, you got the brown shirt, the blue pants. Oh, boy. Let's change these pants colors if we can just a little bit to grayish. There we go. And then the shoe color probably should change a little bit, too, to help everything blend a bit better. So there we go. <laughs> there. Everything's blended. Now, formal look, we want him just to have your average suit and tie. We want him to be just like your average dude. So there we go. We're going to have that. Now, athletic, we want him to wear a lawn sleeve everything so no one can catch on that he's an alien. Maybe he doesn't want to expose any of his parts, his alien parts. So let's exit socks. We'll have him wear a robe to bed. Now, party style... I don't want him to stand out with this either, so I think we're going to go with something like this. Very clean cut. Nothing that's like jumps off the page and says, hey, look at me. Okay, so there we go. This is Rocket Milky Way, our alien, and this is him as an alien. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Let's make his traits. Uh, so let's go here. Now, I'm going to make, um, hmm. I want him to be a knowledgeable sim and a computer whiz because he's got to figure out how to get back home. So I'm going to make sure he's a genius. We're gonna make sure that he is ambitious, so he constantly works to get back home. And then we're gonna have him be a very good sim. Just a nice person, because then he won't attract any negative attention. Okay, so now that Rocket Milky Way's created, let's create his girlfriend. Now they're not married in this scenario. They're actually just dating, and they were actually out on a date when the ship went down. So, so let's uh, make her. Oh god, I got the hiccups, guys. <laughs> oh no, I'm still sick. Okay. So let's go like this. We're going to make that booty uh, in this spacesuit pop a little bit. There we go. Um, and then her hips are really wide, so we're going to bring those in just a little bit. Oh, okay, so purple skin. Um, oh, God, I got the hiccups. Okay, so purple skin. Her boyfriend's got the green skin. I think we're going to have her have a different color skin. Oh, God, I got the hiccups. Let's try... This, like, light purplish pink. I think that looks really ni oh, nice on her. Oh, my God. I got the hiccups, guys. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. I think my hiccup spell is all but done. So, here we go. This is uh, his girlfriend as just her alien self. Uh, I think we're going to go with a different style of shirt or, I mean, uniform. I think I want her to have a similar color to his, but uh, maybe actually different. Yeah, we'll go with white. I think white looks really nice. Now let's find out what her personality is going to be. So we're going to make her a romantic sim. She wants to find a soulmate. That's why she was out on a date, obviously. We're going to make her very um, romantic. Okay. And then we also want her to be uh, creative. Okay. So she's going to kind of envelop a lot more in the human culture of things. And then we want her to be ambitious as well. Okay. So there we go. And they have a couple similar traits and similar ambitions. Now let's design her person. Oh, wait, no, wait. Let's name her first. I already know what I'm going to name her. Obviously, we're going to use the name Nebula. Nebula from Guardians of the Galaxy. That's why we use Rocket as well from Guardians of the Galaxy. Now, her last name is not going to be Milky Way because they're not married. They're just dating. Her last name is going to be Orion. So Orion is like, I think it's like a star or like a, guess, a set of stars. And I'm sure it's not spelled like this, but that's how we're going to do it. Nebula Orion. Um, like Orion's belt. I think that's a belt of stars. Yeah, like a line of stars. So that's why we get her last name. Now let's go on to her, her actual looks. And let's see here. So she is a young adult. We're going to go here and we are going to get her face structure, uh, to go like this. And then I want to get her hair to be, oh, we didn't add hair for her alien part. So we need to add hair for her alien being, and I want her hair to be, um, like a green because I think that'll look really cool especially as an alien so let's try to get the same hairstyle that she had as a human as an alien as well so let's scroll down here there it is and we're gonna get the green and then looks really cool um, I really like that so there we go so she's got the green hair let's go to style look she doesn't know what humans wear either so we're gonna just try to style her up make her look really cool just with the average style looks that looks actually really nice 
Okay, now let's try to... Oh my god, this actually looks really good too. That's uh, but let's try to play with some of these dresses here. I think we're gonna go with something like this. I think she could rock something like that. Oh, wait. She could rock something like this even better, I think. Like the blue. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now let's go to <laughs> the workout fitness. We're ever with a green. My god, she fits in pretty well. I'm not gonna lie with all the other humans. And let's have her wear purple. Exit the socks off. There we go. No socks. That looks pretty nice. Now, uh, so this is party outfit. I don't think that outfit says party. This one kind of does, though. So let's try to go with purple and green. It matches her hair. And then her swimming suit, we're going to have this blue one with the glasses. I really like it. Nebula looks really cool, guys. And then, obviously, we have Rick, or, uh, Rocket Milky Way and Nebula. Oh, my God, guys. I'm excited. I am stoked. Let's move them into a city. Milky Way. Yes, that's the family. They're just dating. They're not, they're not married. They're roommates right now. So, they're not even technically dating. This was like, we could call this their first date. We're going to have them live in Oasis Springs because it's like a desert and like Area 51 conspiracy theories. So, let's have them uh, plop their booties down in one of these homes. So, 13 grand or 17. We're going to go with the $13,000 one. Drop them right there. They're going to go with the furnished option. And I think this is the start to our brand new life. And our brand new series, The Sims 4 Aliens. I hope you guys are really enjoying the series so far. I know it just started, but if you guys are, don't forget to smash that like button. I think this is where we're going to leave off on this series. I'm super stoked, though, about starting this. If you guys are really excited, let me know in the comments and everything. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, remember to take it easy. Live and squeezy.